Miss Lauren here. She's been in Rod's room for a while. Why? Yeah, because I was in Jenny's bathroom and I looked in the garbage can and I saw this. A home pregnancy test? Plus means positive. How do you know? Because the instructions were in there too. So how do you know this is Lawrence? Allison is out of town. And I haven't even kissed Jenny yet, let alone had unprotected sex with her. So... So... Rod's gonna be a father? Suitcases. Oh. And he's off. I thought you were leaving forever. No, I was just circling the block. Why? I'm avoiding Lauren. And ducking responsibility? I'm not ducking responsibility. I'm ducking being a father, Titch. When'd she leave? She didn't. You're so not Delta. Which one of you is the boyfriend? Him. Well, your girlfriend is definitely pregnant. Oh, I'm sorry, I have to take this as the girl I'm currently in love with. Hi, Jenny. Hello. Have you kissed her yet? Uh, no, not yet. Henry? Well, she wants you to. Really? Henry! Yes. Uh, you know what, Jenny, can I give you a call back? So, we're pregnant. Hmm. And how will you be paying for the test? Him. Hey, glasses. Can I speak to you man to man? Do the honorable thing here. Oh, uh, to be honest with you, I'm not really the father. I'm just covering for a friend. Oh. Well, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah. See to it that he does the honorable thing then. And, uh, make a move on this Jenny girl, will ya? Sounds like you've been dragging this thing out. What? Rod, we need to have a serious talk. Them. No, with you. Do you remember how we first met? I took pictures of your boobs. Not a really good start, is it? Pictures or spank bank? Look, if I were to have this baby, would you want to be in its life? No. Good. I don't think I'd want you in its life either. Thanks for nothing, Rod. Goodbye forever. How'd it go? Lauren doesn't want me in Ben Affleck's life. Ben Affleck? Yeah, that's what I wouldn't name the kid. It works for a girl or a boy. Well, are you okay with not being in Ben Affleck's life? I thought I was. But now I feel this pain, like, like, here. I feel like throwing up. You mean you feel bad? That's stupid. I've never been wrong about anything in my entire life. You got a girl pregnant and then ditched her. What could be more wrong than that? I could have peed on her. Would you be serious for a minute? Henry, what's the worst thing you can do to a girl? I don't know. Pee on her? See? All right, besides peeing on her, the worst thing you can do to a girl is get, get her pregnant and then ditch her. Wait, is she really going to keep your child? I just figured, you know, she'd probably just get in the boy. Who wants bagel bites? Have I always been mean to vaginas? The mere fact that you call them vaginas tells What should I call them, Tom? Wieners? Now come on, I want examples. In college you made out with your girlfriend's roommate. But my girlfriend was in the room. Saying please don't make out with my roommate. Well, you could tell she really wanted me to though. 
maybe, maybe I should talk to Lorne. Maybe I should take uh, um, responsibility. Is that the correct use of the word? Yes. Huh. Oh, maybe I should take responsibility. But the two of you are coming with me. Isn't this something you should do alone? No. Henry! Oh, hey, Jenny, how's it going? I thought we had plans to see Transformers today, remember? Yeah, uh, see, the thing is, Rod needs to say something really important to Lauren. Oh, she's been at her cousin's all day. Is everything all right? Which way is her cousin's? We're turning around. Cousin, today I had a life-changing realization so powerful there's not even a word for it yet. It's actually called an epiphany. That is a great made-up word. Thank you, Tom. I had an epiphany. Lauren, I want to be a part of Ben Affleck's life. What? He wants to name your child Ben Affleck. Why? Because it works for a girl or a boy. Let him answer. Because it works for a girl or a boy. Uh, that's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. She's right. Then we can name it something else, both badass and unisex. Jean-Claude Van Damme, cliffhanger. The point is, I want to be there. Can we please just talk in private? Do you know what private means? I'm vague on it. We'll go. This isn't how I pictured my life turning out. What do you mean? I mean, when I thought about Having a child, it wasn't supposed to be with someone like you. You pictured someone less awesome. I pictured someone smarter. You didn't answer the question. I don't love you. I don't love you either. I actually think you might be the stupidest person I've ever met in my entire life. I actually think that your boobs are hot. I mean, could we ever make this work? I think so. Why? Again, your hot boobs. <laughs> you know, after our conversation yesterday, I... Never thought I'd see you again. Kind of like Pearl Harbor. The tragedy? No, the awesome movie. You see, Kate Beckinsale thinks that Ben Affleck is dead. So she has sex with Josh Hartnett in a parachute, but then Ben Affleck returns. So I'm Kate Beckinsale? Yes. And who are you? Hartnett and Affleck combined. That makes no sense. Rod, is there more to you than a DVD collection, a frat boy sense of humor, and those stupid sunglasses? I don't know, but I'm willing to find out. Yeah? You think things will work out for him? I do. Why? He's Rod. Things always work out for him. Well, I guess it's just going to be us then. <laughs> Maybe not. Uh, Jenny, this whole Rod Lauren series situation has sort of got me uh, inspired to do something that I've been wanting to do for a while now, and... Oh, 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 what are you doing? I'm making the first move. Um, would it be okay if I make the first move? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> 